Uh, my name is Katie Haley. I've worked at Beacon Hill for the last six years. Um, I ride, I help around the barn, I help teach a little. I would say our specialty is mostly the equitation and junior riders, but we have a bunch of hunters, jumpers, a little bit of everything, but mostly equitation and the junior riders. Right now we have 42 horses here. We usually range between 40 to 50 in that range. We were using a Google Drive setup that we just kind of started on our own. What I like more about Barn Manager is that it's organized more for uh, horse management and a business like that. The Google Drive, we were able to keep a lot of information, but it was kind of hard to organize since we were flying by the seat of our pants. So, so we started using Barn Manager last uh, late summer, early fall. And I would say since late fall, we've been using it fully for everything we do. Farrier, vets, we use the lease records, uh, feed, and all the stuff they have to offer. Each horse, has a vec record page with the year. So for example, we started last year. Each horse will have their name, uh, dash the year, and then every time they get vet work or the vet looks at them, we type in the notes, the date, and what vet work they got done. And um, we actually just started putting the injections in bold typeface, so those are a little easier to see. You know, there's the shockwave and the stuff we do that's not necessarily time sensitive and then there's the injections so if you have to know the last time a horse got a tox done that will kind of be in bold for you to see and then we also attach all of the vets sheets that they give us so if you needed to look at a more specific or more detailed record of what that horse got done you're able to look at that you can kind of see the whole screenshot of what the horses are doing it's not like you have to click on a record, go back, check another record. And it's also, I've noticed, easier to see if there's a pattern. Like let's say a horse needs his hocks injected every eight months, or we have some that the OSFOS is a little more routine. It's just kind of easy to see it all in one place rather than having to click around a bunch of times. So for the lease records, a lot of the equitation horses specifically, um, Stacia likes to keep around and they just kind of get new uh, people to ride them and to lease them. So. It really just helps to have all of the information stored in one place, both for we know exactly when the leases are coming due, anybody that's in the barn can kind of click on the lease record and see for billing, something as silly as the farrier comes, is it still for this customer, or has the lease changed? Um, just keeping all that organized. It has a nice buyout date feature. We like the email reminders because that way, even as organized as we're trying to be, sometimes it's very easy for things to slip your mind. It's very simple. You know, if a horse is coming up, you get an email and everybody knows about it and everybody knows to kind of keep an eye out for someone new or, you know, at least have them organized to go back to their home. It's just very easy for everybody to be on the same page and get reminded specifically with an email. Especially with 40 to 50 horses, easy that the program keeps track of it all for you.